This is my third installment of a uh, particular palm that's growing in Vero Beach. This is Bentinkia uh, nicobarica or nicobarica. And uh, every two years in February, I, I've been making a video of this just to show its growth and progress because this is a pretty zone bendy palm for this area. It's in a really protected situation. If you've seen the other two videos, um, it's it's out on the beach side in Vero, south end of the county. Uh, it's got a uh, south east facing, more east southeast facing wall that acts as a thermal battery. Of course, you got the structure itself for, um, acting as a barrier for winds. Uh, the Indian River Lagoon is just on the other side of the house, and it's only about a thousand yards from the beach. So it's got a lot of things going for it, which is why it made it through its younger years. I think I put this in in either 2009 or 2010, uh, and it was a large three gallon at the time. So anyway, I just wanted to show this one off at its, uh, uh, however many years that's been, four, a little over four years in the ground. Definitely put on some height. Maybe if it's still alive in two years when I do another video, it will have flowers on it or fruit. So, Once again, Bentinkia nicobarica in Vero Beach. And uh, just as a, a, an amendment at the end of this video, um, I've tried Bentinkia condapana. I was really hopeful about that, and it just did not work out for me. So I'd be curious if anybody else has tried those in uh, Central Florida, if they've had any luck.